we're going to play Star Wars Jedi all in order. This is taking place, I believe, after episode three, before episode four. And uh, I believe it's like... There's probably going to be some character references, but I don't know how many of like the main Star Wars characters will show in here. But I'm kind of excited to see that. For those who don't know, it's... Um, the game is kind of like... Tomb Raider-ish mixed with like Dark Souls styled combat. I've heard it's quite difficult. We're going to play on the hardest difficulty. Yeah, I'm excited. So let's begin. I started it up to try and just make sure everything worked. Uh, I haven't even gotten into any combat or anything. So um, I have no idea how that's going to work, but I'm ready to dive in here and this will be... We'll play this from beginning to end over the next few weeks. So thank you guys for coming. So basically, after Anakin became Vader, but before Luke Skywalker became Jedi. Yes, exactly. After Vader, before Luke. That's how I described it as well. Uh, I'm playing on uh, on PC. I'm using a controller, in case anybody's curious. And are you guys ready? Are you ready to begin? Okay, let's begin. Welcome to Star Wars. We're going to go Jedi Grandmaster. This is going to be a challenge. It's going to be a challenge. Let's go. Set your rhythm, Cal, but the boss wants a word. It's gonna be good for us. Here he is, Chief. An error has been detected on line 10A. All our clamps are jammed. I need two workers to climb up and secure the cables. That's not an easy maneuver. The gal will double your pay for this shift. Come on, Cal. What's her score? That couldn't hurt. I really like this actor. Uh, he's in Shameless and some other stuff, but Shameless is where I know him from. And uh, he's really, really talented. Really good. Uh, how is the game volume compared to me? Are we good? Game volume up. All right, let me know if we need to do any uh, other adjustments. Hey, thanks, Peachy Games. I love starting new games. This is like, it's the best feeling. Like, you don't really know what you're going to be running into, and. Uh, yes, I'll be uploading these to YouTube. Up here. After you, kid. Will you look at that? A separatist ship. I haven't seen a Luke or Hulk in ages. Yeah. Ages. Breaking her will be big money. All right, let's go. Well, I've definitely got They've nailed the, the vibes for sure. Look out! Heads up! Get help! Hey, 
Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Ladder's out, though. Gonna have to find another way. I got no you. Problem. I'll improvise. That's cool. You mark this barge immediately. You are not approved trash. Trash? It's not approved trash. I'm pretty sure that was an insult. Nice. Hey, Erlenmeyer, thank you so much. Hurry up. We're close to finishing ahead of schedule. I can just about taste the credits. It's gonna be a wild night tonight. Let's get this job done. Now, I don't know how much exploring or, and stuff there is to do in these early sections. But I do understand that it opens up a little bit, and then we'll kind of want to spend some time looking around. What's my game of the year? Why is it Sekiro? I don't know. I'd have to think about my game of the year. like scrap rats creepy just passing through guys no need to come out and say hi this time the sound is really good Meet you the clamps. Sounds good. Be there soon. Thank you very much, Derpeg. I appreciate that, man. Thank you so much. The controls feel really good. Whoa. And I like when games don't try to like change mechanics that you would be used to. You look at it and you're like, okay, I need to hold, I need to grab onto this, and it just kind of works. How'd you get here? How'd you get here? Huh? <laughs> Jeez. Ow. Hey, Zor, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thanks for coming. Protagonists always have massive stamina in their hand muscles. Oh, what? <laughs> I can't grab that or what? Just as I was saying that. There we go. Everything would work as naturally as you would think. Look at this, man. That's awesome. That is so cool. I just kind of want to, like, fanboy out on stuff, if that's cool. <laughs> I don't know if any of you guys are into uh, Lego, but um, this year I picked up a couple of Star Wars sets, and I'm going to build them when we move, but I've got the uh, Millennium Falcon and the Imperial... Uh, is it just called the Imperial Destroyer? I think it's just called the Imperial Destroyer. Uh, where are we supposed to go from here? Oh, cool.
You're partially here because of the fanboying now. <laughs> That's good. Before they start cutting this wing. Like, man, uh, honestly, the sense of scale is really well done. It's kind of blowing my mind a little bit. Like, look at this! That's awesome, man. <laughs> I can't wait to start fighting. And dying. Look at that thing. Oh, I can't look down. Oh, there it is. What the hell? What is that? Sure, I'm sure that'll be the first thing that eats us. Oh, okay. Your turn. Can I make this jump? Or am I trying to get up here now? Now we're blocked here. Hello. Okay? Hello. Still here. Ugh. Give me a fright there, pal. Done. Hang on. I got this. Uh, uh. I like how this is just casual work for us. Get out up here. Like we've done this thousands of times. Come take a look at this. It's a Jedi fighter. What a score! A Sarlacc pit. I mean, this he's been here what four years? Five. <laughs> Never flew this, went down in a blaze of glory. Those Jedi. Real tragedy. I've always said they couldn't all be traitors. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I guess it's just our lucky day. Empire's gonna get a lot of good material out of it. Yeah, here we are, scrapping these ships from the war, just so they can turn around and make new ones. What a racket, huh? All of us risking our necks for the bosses. And the pay was better back during the Republic, too. Hey, you really should watch what you say. Listen to me. Find us free like this? It could be your ticket off this soggy rock. What makes you think I want out of here? <laughs> Come on, Cal, you <laughs> Look around. Guy. You don't end up like me. <sighs> Eventually, you gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Whatever you say. Hey, we should get back down. You're not listening to me. What is that? Hello. Okay. Uh, we're playing on PC, Carp. But I'm using a controller. Okay. Bro, you okay? Cal, I, I can't climb up. Bro, I'm just hanging on. No, don't let go. I, I can't hold on. Bro, no. Oh, sick. You okay, bro? I'll probably still hurt a lot. Pin down. Pilot's gone. I'll get us out of here. Just hang on. Watch out, Cal. Okay, this might actually be the first thing that kills us. This thing is barely flying. Hold on. You all right? Yeah. Okay, we gotta. We gotta move. Come on. Hell happened. What was that back there? Was, it, was that you? 
Well, that, that, that was the force, wasn't it? Just forget what you saw, okay? Please, no, trust me. I've seen, the, I've, I've seen the stories. I've heard it. There's bounties out on people I like know. you. I know. Yeah, we're ready. We need to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. I'm already a big fan of Prof. He kind of has like um uh Jar Jar Binks sense of like trustworthiness, you know? Like Jar Jar's probably one of my favorite characters. You holding up okay? Prof has good vibes, yeah, agreed. Yeah. yeah. Kel. I've been working with you some time now. I've never seen you do anything like that before. Well, we've been through some hell together. <laughs> so, I know the risk that you took for me. I just, I don't know how to repay you. Don't mention it. I mean it. Well, you don't have to worry about me. This place. That's one of the nice things about being like a newcomer to a huge, uh, to something that already has a huge fan base, is like, I don't worry about what the preconceptions of different characters and stuff are. Like some people in chat are saying like, oh, I'm not a huge, like, that's really brave to say that you like Jar Jar Binks or whatever. Uh, that doesn't mean anything to me because I'm just, I get to look at it with fresh eyes and it's just what stands out to me. Prof? And I don't have the years of, like, debate to reference, you know what I mean? Prof, wait up! Wait. What is happening here? What the f- I thought they were just vanishing, but then I was like, uh, I, like, I wonder if the characters glitched out or something, but no. Where are you going? I'm not crazy. Maybe dreaming? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! We've been layers of feared. Hell yeah. Everybody up. Identification ready. 
These are the guys with the excellent aim. Am I right? Move out and line up. Probably just another contraband inspection. Do Jedi's have regular dreams or are they all force visions? Is this all of them? Second sister. We seek a dangerous fugitive. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. <sighs> Failure to turn over this traitor will result in a charge of sedition. Turn yourself in, or everyone present shall face summary execution. And what do you do? I think it's time someone came forward. Don't do it, Prof. I no. Am. I've been working on this heap a long time. Way before the war. We refit and rebuilt ships. Best in the galaxy. Then came the Empire. And engineers became scrappers. The workers? They just started getting worked. Prof. We all know the truth. We're just uh -oh. too afraid to say it. To the Empire, we're all just expendable. Yes, you are. <laughs> no! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> well, that backfired because now I found he's Jedi. toast. Why would they drop us? Hold it. Go move. How'd you get here? Easy now. Got a stowaway. Hey, you don't need to call this in. Oh, Jedi! Oh, oh, that feels really good. Oh, oh you guys, this is going to be exceptional. <laughs> okay. All I'm doing, I'm swinging it air, and it's already awesome. Okay, let's roll. Hold to black block blaster bolts. Oh, we just auto block. Uh, I got this. Uh, okay. Hello. Oh, sick, man. Okay, this is really neat. <laughs> okay. This is awesome. Uh, we're playing on the hardest difficulty, Levin is. I should maybe make a command or something. A lot of people seem to be asking. One way out. Holy frick. Uh, is this something I can grab? Yes. Gotta keep moving.
target lock and then switch targets. That's how I prepare. Okay. Hold to block most enemy attacks. Your block stamina decreases while blocking attacks. Seems like you're hurt. Oh shit! Come on, traitor. Let's do this. Plastic coward. Whoa! Okay. Slow an enemy. Please the force meter attack enemies to fill it. Use the force on objects with a blue outline. Oh my god. This is probably where we die. Whoops. Damage enemies to regain force. We need to heal or something. Oh, cool. I think we probably could have jumped down on him. Are you serious? This is going to be rough, guys. Damn! Okay, that's death one. That's death one. <laughs> Holy frick. Okay. Four of them at once right now? Pretty intense. Pretty intense. We'll start to build... We'll build a rhythm. We'll become a Jedi Master. Very soon. Come on now. Trying to find that window. There we go. Okay, it's really small. The window is really small. Get to the front. Stop the train. Uh, hello. Gotta move in between bursts. Now. We don't have like a slide or anything.
faster. Whoa! You there? I'm ready for your trick. Oh, thank you. Thank you. He shot the coupling out. Gotta get down. This is no joke right now. Holy. Oh, this is like some uncharted train climbing. Whoa, I love it. Only way is up. Oh my god. I wouldn't be asking any questions. How are we going to deal with this? We'll try and shoot some bullets back, I guess. Whoops. Oh, that was cheap. Do we block the bullets from all sides, or is it only the ones that are coming at us from the front? Oh, this can't be good. Whoa, jeez. <laughs> Whoa. I don't like this. Oh, cool. Very convenient. Hold on. All sides, but you can only reflect them back. So, if we're dealing with shooting, we just basically hold block the whole time. Regardless of the angle. That is how it's done. Going somewhere. 
Oh, she's gonna. I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. We're about to get destroyed. Who is your master? Padawan? Someone I killed, perhaps? What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? Oh, cool. You can't run forever. Faster than I thought. There we go. Oh, what was she doing there? That strike will be your last. He's super strong. Evade the attack. Right attacks or unblock. Oh, okay. I gotcha. Let's end it. Holy frick. Come on! Get on board! There were a couple times there where I thought I had parried her, but then she went into some red move. I don't know if you can parry all enemies or not either, so we'll have to figure that out as we go. I'm pretty sure that's not going to do anything. Close door, fly! Whoa. Oh, you can't parry her in that fight? Interesting. Okay, shut that thing off and grab some seat. That's how you do Thanks an opening. Right there. But who are you people? My name is Seer Junda, and this is my captain, Grease Dritus. How you doing? Yeah, the man is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal, Kestis. Who was that back there? An Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors, and now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? Well, it's the bounty on Jedi these days anyway. That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. You too? Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? I like his the voice. Jedi Council? They're gone. Oh. So I'm all you've got. Captain, set a course for Bagano. Aye, aye. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. Her eyes are like very intense.
Okay, we can breathe. Wow. Yeah, that's awesome. What a way to start. Find your destiny. You were talking in your sleep. Weirdo. Yeah, pronounced is maybe an understatement. <laughs> well, that was weird. What is this? What did that mean? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven strings? Banjo. Space banjo. <laughs> that song. I wrote it. Years ago. Hey, Aria, thank Such you. an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. Well, that's what that it's was. An echo in the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi. But not anymore. That's not very common, right? No. But I knew your master, Jarrod DePaul. He was a true guardian of the Republic. He was a hero. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but... My connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down... I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We'll come up on our destination. Jedi I knew discovered it before the purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists. No. So? Not rare, but it's plan? also not common. Hide out here? We're done. Oh, it's average. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know. Very you convenient. Don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy and a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. Looking for a Jedi, then. Bill if points. There's already one here. Why does Seer need me? That's the question. <laughs> Look at these little guys. I just want to see. Oh, hello. Oh, hey, there, little guy. What the?
Okay. Is this like a puzzle room or something? Keep this in mind and come back later. This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. So I imagine these are kind of like uh, bonfires then? Save points. They're located throughout Cal's journey. Make sure to interact with them to save your progress. Save points are where Cal can rest and spend skill points to acquire new skills. Okay. Um, you have enough skill points to learn new skills. Open the skill tree to use them. Let's see what we got going on here. Spend your skill point to learn overhead slash. Okay. This is all that we have. Ooh. Unlocks a powerful strike that's deadly against weaker enemies with Y. Got it. Oh, there we go. And now we can kind of go into whatever we want. So we have uh, maximum life. Defenses are improved, allowing him to take less block stamina damage. Perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash. A dash strike. If you hold Y, dashes forward and attacks his target... Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. Uses force. Okay, so we'll have to figure out... Because that's pretty limited, it seems. But anything that uses force is going to drain that super quick. Evasive kick. Uh, attacking after a quick evade allows Cal to perform a quick kick attack. Attacking out of a sprint allows Cal to perform a special lightsaber attack. Ooh. Al's maximum force is increased. Probably valuable. Holding slow allows Cal to use his... Uh, to slow his target for a longer duration. Alright. Oh, can we view these two, like, right now? Oh, that's really nice. That's so cool that it lets you see how this works. That's awesome. Okay. Wait, are there more? I just noticed, like, survival and force. And, okay, so that's just this immediate tree. It doesn't change. This is all we have. Um, survival stuff on the right, lightsaber stuff in the middle, and then force. Play this on PC by getting a month of Origin Premiere for 15 bucks. Nice. That's pretty good. It looks really good. Like, it feels great. There's a couple of, like, uh, seems to be when some things, like, are loading in. Like a little bit hey, of a stutter, but. BD1. I'm Cal. Hey, Badonk. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on. It's like stoked. Did you just slice that? Thanks. Hey, I just want to see, like, what else is going on here before we commit. Is that something I can grab? It looks like we could probably grab that. Let's see if we come around from the other side, maybe. Ah. But we can climb vines. BD has so more personality than the entire prequel Reverend trilogy. Must be waiting there. Savage. Objective added to the hollow map. Okay. Let's do it. Current objective can always be seen on BD1's hollow map. Oh, damn. Okay, so, like, it doesn't... It doesn't show us... Th I guess we have to... This only gets mapped out as we go through it. Am I making that assumption correctly? Okay, 
how do we back out of here? Multiple floors. Oh, it's asking me to use all each of the controls. Okay. The hollow map also shows unexplored pathways and important landmarks. Yeah, see, look at this. It just opens up and looks like we can kind of go wherever we want. Whoa! <laughs> hey, that's not a jump we can make. Got like a little old dome set up for us. That's a really big bug. Let's see what they got. Oh. Feel it? Oh, hello, Jesus. What the? What? Scared the hell out of me. I feel like there's uh, going to be a lot of stuff hidden. Hence, Echo. It was after boggling <clears throat> eggs and the pack fought back. BD1 is busy? Dead flocks. Boggling studies. Dead blocks killed by boglings when it attempted to raid their nest. Okay. Is that stuttering like a known issue? You can kind of sense it. It's not terrible, but it's definitely there. No way through here. Guess that's why BD1 warned me. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time. Now, if we rest, I imagine we're healed back up. Yeah, see, like, look, there's a big itch there. And we'll figure out if this respawns enemies as well. Life and force have been restored. Enemies have respawned. Okay, cool. So it's exactly like souls. The occasional stutter does become noticeable, yeah. Because there's parts where it's really smooth, you you don't notice it at all. But. Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. Take me there, BD. Is it blind? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, cool. We use him. How'd you know that would work? Wait, you did. <clears throat> now, are these also uh, quick travel points where we can jump between these meditation spots? I hear you, but there's something over here I want to explore. Oh, cool. We'll even, like, call him out. We go off the path. Yes.
wonder how lost we're gonna get because I can see that being an issue. I feel like maybe uh, lightsabering support beams, maybe not the greatest idea. Oh, oh that's cool. That thing looks like it smells worse than green Whoa! Stuff. Hey, I hit him. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> Is he kind of stuck in there? <laughs> I feel like I might be cheesing him a little bit. Whoa. Oh, that overhead thing is using force, too. I didn't realize. <laughs> using them. Yikes. Oh, I could have just killed him in there. I didn't know he would one-shot us. When you die, you lose all your XP gained since your last skill point. Damaging the enemy who kills you will restore your lost XP and refill your life and force to its maximum. Holy! <laughs> he one-shot us. Okay, we can just kill him the other way. That's awesome. Okay, okay, okay. Healing takes time, so be aware of your surroundings. I didn't even know we could heal. See how it goes when you try to play fair? <laughs> yeah. That's cool though. I'm going I'm going right back in. But he he won he just straight up okay. He just straight up one shots us. May the force of cheesiness be with you. Hey man! If it lets me do it, I'll kill him. Judging by how strong that is. Am I stuck on this? Ogdo Bogdo. Oh, I just realized it probably there's probably an argument to be made where uh, you should like fight a bit before you get your stuff back. Oh, God damn it. It's the uh, range of your saber is a little smaller than I would think. It's taken a bit to get used to. Dude. Whoa. See, like, I feel like all of those should have hit, but a bit weird. Oh, 
Oh oh. That's scary, man. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, he's dead. We got him. Jeez, yeah, that may be. Look at that experience. Holy. 